Hello Leo, this is your today's love reading and extra extended on my Patreon. Link is below if you'd like to join for only $16 for all extended reading. Thank you so much for subscribing to my channel and to my Patreon family. I appreciate your love and support. It means a lot to me. Now Leo, please don't forget that this is a general reading. It may not be your story or message. Kindly use your best judgment and this reading will not be conveyed with specific rules because again it is not a personal reading. As we go along with it, you will know where you stand in the storyline and Leo this reading um, time is fluid so this could resonate with you in the past currently or in the future all right Leo let's get your reading started spirits and angels please show me important accurate love messages for Leo today please show me more Leo, please bear in mind that roles can be reversed in this reading. Could either be you or the other person you are thinking about or dealing with, okay? So we've got the fool in reverse. Definitely an indication of somebody. Um, I feel like somebody could have taken a risk, okay, in the past. Possibly putting you in a third party or vice versa. Three of Pentacles is here. It does indicate a third party or could also mean that someone may not want to take a chance in reconciling with the Three of Pentacles. Could mean reconciliation as well. Building something, fixing this connection. Um, hmm. Judgment is in reverse. So an indication of somebody who could have made the wrong judgment call um, or somebody not wanting to go back to the past. Knight of Wands, sorry, King of Wands is right here. This is actually your energy, Leo, Sagittarius, Aries. But it could be your person as well. Your person could have fight in the chart. But I do see somebody watching somebody here. Um, definitely, I'm sensing it's a third party situation. Or somebody perhaps looking towards, uh, perhaps if things were, if things were different, as in if, if both of you were to, you know, I don't know if this is how you feel or your past person, again, roles can be switched here, but then it, it, there's a sense of someone thinking, you know, what would it have been if we were to actually work together, work as a team to try and fix this situation, okay, in, you know, in regards of your connection with each other. But the Nine of Cups is in reverse here, Leo, so this means that um, somebody is definitely not happy, okay, or will not be happy, con will not be contented with the the choice that they have made in the past. I'm predicting this is in the future, okay, that somebody could have made a, a judgment call that eventually they are going to regret and they're going to feel that, um, that they made the wrong choice, okay? For some of you, it could be third party situation. For some of you, you know, third party may not always mean love another lover. It could mean, you know, um, external factors, internal factors, friends, family who could have meddled into this situation. But I definitely see somebody regretting for making the wrong choice, okay? The tower is in reverse, definitely wanting to recover the situation, wanting to undo the damages that have been done in this connection. Seven of Swords is here, at Leo. So I do sense somebody trying to sneak their way back into your life. Could be you or them. Again, roles can be switched here. Three of Cups is in reverse. It does look like whatever choice that they made, uh, in the past to not choose you, okay? Um, or it could be anything, right? It just didn't work out. I'm sensing all that it's not going to work out for them, okay? Nine of Pentacles is right here. This could be you, okay? Um, but again, roles can be switched here. But this is definitely somebody whom is very independent, very abundant, okay? A very rich. <laughs> Depends how you see rich, what rich is to you. Every Everyone's definition of rich is definitely not the same. But monetarily, I would say you are independent, Um or very self-sufficient, okay? You could have a, you have a good job or that. You're making your own money. Whether you're rich or not monetarily, it just indicates somebody 
you know, uh, very self dependent. Uh, self-reliant and very independent and absolutely gorgeous as well um it does look like um if this is you leo you're somebody who takes care of um, how you look you know you're very well groomed very absolutely beautiful can be a doesn't matter he or she okay um, it's not gender specific but somebody who dresses well as well so i do send somebody watching you okay uh, your past could be watching you and seeing you actually looking really good or doing really well in your career or business ten of wands in reverse so an indication of somebody wanting to let go of all of this burden um, and nine of pentacles also is a singlehood card somebody who could be single but it may not mean that you are completely single you could be dating other people but you know yourself comes first and then the knight of cups is right here leo so it does look like somebody wants to come back and offer you a new um i'm sensing this could be an apology coming in in the future okay perhaps from your past person but this could also be somebody new okay and we've got the Queen of Wands right here. Um, I'm sensing this could be you as well because uh, this is a fire sign. Leo, Sagittarius, Aries, unless Rose is being reversed here. Um, unless also if this is the third party, right? For some of you, you could have found out about the third party with the High Priestess in reverse. Secrets, perhaps somebody was hiding in the past could have been revealed some sneakiness here the party situation or cheating lying i do get that as well in this reading and eight of wands is right here an indication of somebody perhaps wanting to come in and communicate with you about something so it does look like this could be good news coming in for you guys leo and also we've got the knight of cups queen of wands good news that's coming in that i'm sensing could be passionate good news okay news from somebody either from your past or somebody new some of you you've been definitely meeting somebody new while you're embracing your singlehood um but for some of you it could be a past person coming in wanting to um wanting to communicate all right Ace of Cups in reverse, but somebody, for some reason, I do sense somebody could be waiting for an offer from somebody to come back in from the past, wanting to start a new beginning, but there is some sort of a delay. So the Hermit is right here. I don't know why I'm sensing the Hermit is being very patient this time around. It could be you feeling very patient or, or seeking from within, trying to find answers. And it's not just about that, but with a little lamp here, it does to me indicate also a little bit of a hope, although in the darkness right now, there could be some uncertainties right now going on between you and your past person or in your love life uh, in general. It could mean that um, somebody is seeing or trying to see if there is a light at the end of the tunnel here. All right. So Leo, we're going to bring this to the extended First, uh, we're going to find out how does your person where you are in separation right now currently feel about you? What are their true intentions right now? And also, what is the most likely outcome based on the current energy between you and your person? Okay, Leo, uh, as you guys know, I post your video right away after I finish the reading. I don't keep the video till and then post it next week or anything like that. So everything is as current as um, possible as life as possible all right it takes me like two minutes to upload it so um always i always do it right after the reading all right so we're gonna find out the most current feelings your person uh, feel about you what are their true intentions and what's the most likely outcome and i would like to also find out about the eight of wands here what is this good news coming in what is this communication all about okay um and also at the same time i'd like to find out for you guys about a possible new love coming in for you okay still a lot of uh, past energy looming over the situation and we're going to pull out some more cards here we're going to find out more um for those who are single and looking does look like a lot of you are single or keeping your options open some of you are could be seeing somebody new but very very extremely new <laughs> okay but some of you are completely single and looking for um, perhaps wanting to know if there is a potential in love in the near future we're also gonna look uh, we are also going to find out in the extended reading okay and we're gonna get you some advice with the oracle 
the Romance Angels Oracles here. Leo, the link is in the description box below. You can just click on it and it will bring you to my Patreon page. For this reading, it's only for Platinum members, so it's $16 and you can watch all of the extra extended, weekly extended reading, all right? Leo, please take care. We part ways here. Thank you so much for watching. If you resonated, please hit like, share, and subscribe. And thank you so much again for watching. Please take care if I don't see you back. Uh, if I don't see you at the Patreon page, uh, I hope to see you back here. Take care, Leo. Bye.